Welcome to Go Okanagan. Coming to you today from the Rotary Center for the Arts in Kelowna. And on today's show, we're going to check out one of the original art studios here. It's the Potter's Attic, where uh, local craftspeople turn out these fantastic works of uh, pottery and stuff. And on today's show, I'm even going to get a chance to, to try and make my very own pot. All right, Bonnie, well, I've rolled up my sleeves. Yep. You've given me this the uh, apron. On. The apron. I, I have a feeling this is going to get dirty. Yeah, it's going to get down and dirty, Doug. <laughs> So, so what have we got here? We've got a piece of clay on here. I right. wedged it up for you and put it on here. And so you got uh, the basics done here. That's right. Point. Well, I got the starting point, and now yeah. you're going to go on with the finished product. All right. Okay. So what are we what are we going to work on today? <coughs> well, um, I think probably the best thing to do would we're going to make a bowl. So put your hand around the clay. Around it. Yep. It's a sensuous thing, you see. Oh yeah. Keep your thumb up in the air, and you're going to push. Whoa! Push here, push here. Push here. All right, you got to come up though. Yeah, keep pushing. Okay. Both hands are pushing. You're bringing it up. Yeah, and then cone Whoa. into a cone. That's right. Don't panic. <laughs> okay, we're gonna cut that off right there. Okay. All right. All right. So cut that off. Just take it off with your thumb. Just. Yep. Good. Off like yep. that. Just like that. So push towards this hand. Push. Like this. Yep. Perfect. Oh, look at that. It's so cool how it yep. just. Yeah. Don't take your hand off center. Oh, okay. So there you cool go. How it just starts to move around yep. like All that. All right, stop. You're done, and you're gonna touch with your index finger and your thumb. Yeah. And you're not gonna go down sideways. You're gonna go straight up and down. Okay. Push down hard. Keep going. All right. I think you should stop there. So okay. you're right down there, yep. and you're gonna dig your hand across like this and make a little cave in there. That's right. Slowly. Keep going. Perfect. Keep going. Now dig that cavern in slowly, slowly. Whoa, whoa it takes off on yeah, you. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Yep, and push in. Good, good one. Keep going. A little bit firmer. Okay, now very gently stop and come away from the clay. Good. Okay. It's kind of hypnotic. Yes, it is. How did you get started doing this? Actually, well, I went to university in Calgary and I was a painting major. Uh -huh. And I had to have one other. Yeah. So I took ceramics. So I triple majored in painting, printmaking, and ceramics. And then when I got out of university, I went straight into clay and gave up the painting and the printmaking. So you're just compressing the rim a little bit. Okay, that's basically the first step. The first step? Yeah. Now, How many steps are there? There's a few. Don't push out, just push in. Yeah, keep coming, beautiful. And gently ease off, good. Go over your rim again, that's good. That was a nice pull. Yeah, or you can do it like this and push that rim in. It's looking kind of bowl-like. It's starting to, so now you're gonna do one more pull. Remember, your hands have to touch. Beautiful, yeah, keep coming up, perfect. Yep. You're doing really good. Walking me through it. Yeah, it's not well, too this terrifying. is how you teach people. I, I don't believe in putting 10 people on the wheel and everybody going for it. So now you're going to make your the next pull right here. Lean on the clay just a little bit. Yeah, nice. And re release gently. And then take the water out. That's really good, Doug. You're going to lean on that clay a little bit. That's perfect. Keep coming. Yeah, okay, not so hard. Easy, easy, easy. Okay, and easy. Oops. Easy means stop. So this is just one of the classes that we teach. We teach uh, hand building, right. uh, which is building things with slabs of clay. We right. teach sculpture, glaze technology. Yeah, push down with your sponge, that's it. Beautiful. I want you to push right there. Just push out with your sponge right down here at the bottom. Look at that thing. So what do you think? That's so cool. Like, it's just gone from a blob of clay yeah. into a bowl. And now we're going to cut it with the wire. Like this, you're going to come in and you're going to go around with the right hand. Right. And this hand is sort of stationary. So it's like that, and then you just bring it till it touches. And then bring the right side around more. Good one. Oh, there there we go. you go. Now lift the whole thing up. I'll put this under there. Don't pan it. Just put it down. <laughs> it feels, ah. Yeah. Oh, okay. Pull out together. Yeah, one's coming and the other one's stuck. That's okay. Oh, there we go. go. 
perfect. Oh, it's still round too. <laughs> so there's Doug's pot. Wow, that's fantastic. Well, thank you so much, Bonnie. That's amazing. You're welcome. I feel, I feel like a creator here almost. Yeah, Although I don't think I would have got very far without your helping hands. No, I don't think so. Not the first time anyway. <laughs> there it is. Look at that. Pretty cool, eh? Just waiting for it to dry. What? Oh, it's going to take about a week. So, yeah, maybe we'll check in later. Uh, anyway, drop by the Rotary Center for the Arts. Pick up your Potter's Attic pamphlet. It's chock full of the classes, courses, and ways that you can get involved. The whole family can get involved in, uh, in uh, you know, playing in the mud. I tell you, it's a lot of fun. All right, that is it for the show. Thanks to Bonnie and everybody down here for letting us come in and make a mess. And if you want to see the finished product, just check out our uh, Go Okanagan Facebook page or our Twitter feed. Okay, thanks for watching. I'm Doug Brown. See you next time on Go.